Are there aliens on Titan? New research suggests that Saturn's moon Titan may contain the key elements of life. Using data from NASA's Cassini satellite, one study found that Titan's upper atmosphere is home to carbon chain anions. These serve as a stepping stone to more labyrinthine molecules that can develop life. Separately, another study found vinyl cyanide in Titan's atmosphere. Scientists speculate that this forms the outer wall of a cell and protects the biochemistry that takes place within. Titan's atmosphere is one of the most complex observed by astronomers, and these studies further bolster the idea the moon may be home to organic life. Do you enjoy news about potential alien life? Sure you do! Want to see some more? Of course you do! A nearby star is emitting weird radio waves. A star close to our solar system was found last week to be playing some pretty weird jams on the radio. Well, not exactly. The Arecibo Observatory in Puerto Rico discovered peculiar radio signals coming from the star Ross 128 in the Virgo constellation. Scientists say the reason for this could be one of three things. The signals could have originated from a solar flare, from something else passing in front of the telescope's view of Ross 128, or it could simply be a radio burst from a high-orbit satellite. Researchers say the recurring hypothesis that aliens are behind the signal is at the bottom of many other explanations. So it's probably not E.T. or the Death Star, Spock or the Saiyans. This jumbo-sized planet Earth may support alien life. American scientists have discovered a supersized Earth-like planet in a nearby star system that could support alien life. Exoplanet LHS 1140b orbits a red dwarf star every 25 days, at a proximity 10 times closer than Earth to the Sun. This red dwarf star is much dimmer and cooler than our Sun, meaning the star's habitable zone is closer. However, its cosmic radiation could still damage the planet. LHS 1140b is 1.4 times the size of planet Earth, but is almost 7 times heavier, indicating that it's likely composed of rock and an iron core. It's because of this density that researchers believe the planet may be robust enough to endure the radiation and still hold water. Scientists will be able to examine the 5 billion year old exoplanet much further after NASA launches the James Webb Telescope in 2018. NASA reckons the moons of Jupiter and Saturn may support life. New research from NASA suggests that the vast oceans found on moons orbiting Saturn and Jupiter could support microorganic life. On Enceladus, Saturn's sixth largest moon, the Cassini spacecraft found evidence of hydrogen gas during a deep dive through a water plume in October of 2016. Hydrogen and other chemical elements along with water and energy are key for supporting life. Scientists suspect this points to the possibility of microbial life existing on Enceladus. Separate but similar research concerning water plume eruptions from Europa, the fourth largest of Jupiter's moons, may also point to life there. The Hubble Space Telescope observed eruptions from a warm area on Europa twice in a two-year period, each higher than the last. NASA will investigate this thermal activity further in the 2020s, when the Europa Clipper spacecraft is launched. 